Hello my other funsters and welcome to part 40 of Zelda Ocarina of Time walkthrough let's play. My name is Mala. Uh, last time we continued further into the darkness of the Shadow Temple and this time we're going to go even further. We're going to uh, use the Boat of the Damned to reach the Land of the Dead and see if we can't face off against Bongo Bongo. Alright, let's go. Uh, oh yes, we wanted um, the Ocarina so that we can protect ourselves against the Gibdos. Because the Sun Song freezes them so they can't hunt me. They can still scream though. When they scream, they like freeze you. It's a really creepy noise as well. Let me see if I can get them to do it. He's not going to do it now, is he? They do the screen, it's really creepy. Although it's more creepy on um, the uh, in Wind Waker. The Gibdo scream in Wind Waker is just haunting. It's so scary. Ugh. <laughs> just thinking about it, it's giving me the heebies, man. It's horrible. Anyway, um, all of these chests in here, there are many, if I remember rightly, are useless. Apart from this one. So we're going to get this one. Is it invisible? Oh, it's invisible. There it is, look. Happy days, right. So now we move on to the boat. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to open the way uh, so we can make that uh, shortcut that I mentioned earlier. Uh, the way to do that is to move this block out of the way and then underneath where the block used to be is a shortcut back to near the beginning of the dungeon of the temple uh, we need the block anyway uh, in order to get up onto the boat so we're going to use it such waiting <laughs> come on <laughs> Come on, Link, you can push harder than that. Oh god, we're only halfway there. Uh, 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 uh. Push that block, Link. There we go. Right, lovely. Right, right, can we go up? Yeah, there we go, we go, we're going up. We go, we go, we go, we go, and up, up. Um, is there a Skulltula there that I can attack? Can I get it from here? With a long shot? I think I can. Ah, oh, you gotta love the long shot. That's awesome. Happy, happy days. Right. Let's go then, shall we? Uh, we'll, uh, we'll play the ocarina. We'll start the event. Ghost ship into the land of the dead. And what do you normally find on ghost ships? What would you say is the most primary thing that you would find on a ghost ship? Hmm? I think it would be skeletons. There you go! <laughs> Not treasure, skeletons! Here they are, look, see? <laughs> I need the normal boots. No, I don't actually. I need the hover boots to get off this thing when we get to the end, so I'll keep the hover boots on. You definitely find skeletons on a ghost ship, man. Definitely. Why would you find treasure on a ghost ship? It's a ghost ship. It's not like a pirate ship, it's a ghost ship. Oh, see you later, loser! <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. <laughs> that was brilliant. <laughs> oh, brilliant, man. I didn't even know that could happen. <laughs> right, we'll jump off the, uh, the, uh, 
Yeah, we'll jump off it now. It sinks anyway. Um, there you go. Ship is sinking, abandon ship. ship. And then it does a little like jig, and then yeah, it's gone. So if you're not off it by then, you, you die and you have to go back and do it again. Right. Now. Now, Cherith. I'm going to use Ferrari's wind. Don't distract me. <laughs> Alright, it's cool. It's just on the normal thing anyway. <laughs> so this room looks simple, but what you can't see, and what those um, creepy hand uh, enemies clearly can see, uh, are the invisible walls. So there you go, look, there's walls. Oh no, they obviously can't see them, otherwise he wouldn't have tried to attack me. Anyway, moving on, let's just ignore the creepy hands and we'll just go through the door. Oh, this is an interesting room. This took me a while to figure out. Because, like, it appears that there's nothing you can do against these. And they gradually come towards you. You can walk out of the room and reset them. Uh, but there's really no need because they're made of wood. And so are susceptible to fire. Ta-da! And it attacks the, uh, um... Redead in here as well. You dead. What's in here? Just more rupees, I think. Lame. Alright, so look. It's the boss door. Is he going to scream? No, he didn't scream. He pretty much didn't seem that bothered that I was even there until I killed him. <laughs> there we go. Right, so we've got the boss key. We do need one more small key though before we can continue. So back in the invisible wall room, we'll go to the next door. We'll ignore the creepy hands. Oh right, this is a waste of time. Uh, we'll get the um, Skulltula, uh, but the other only thing for... Because you can um, these skulls you can put bombs in, but all you get is money. So uh, we're full on money at the moment anyway. So we'll just get the Skulltulas and then we'll, we'll hop out and we'll get the key. Right, so let's go get the key. Right. So... Invisible wall room again. We need to go towards this creepy dude. Oh no! Once they turn green, they're invincible. Uh, until they um, land and are no longer green. But anyway. Oh my god, no. No, don't make me fight this. Because then they split into three. Oh no, I hate this! If you don't kill them in good time, then they, they turn big, um, and then you've got a real big problem on your hands. Whew, they're dead though, we're good. <laughs> you seriously have to kill them so fast, otherwise they turn big, it's horrible. Oh. Right, we have the last thing we need in order to complete this temple. So let's go for it. Is it this way? No, go away. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Right. We're just going to ignore the enemies. It's this way, I think. Yeah. See, so this blue, th uh, this green thing is where we put the four orange wind, so this has to be the way back. There we go. This took me a while to figure out. There's bombs over there. What we can do. Fire arrow them to set them off. Happy days. Boom, 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 boom. Ah, 
ha <laughs> the only thing that does kind of give the game away is if you break these uh, these uh, little pots one of them has arrows in it uh, and the other one has magic in it although that didn't seem to give me anything you get the idea though it kind of gave me the idea of what I was supposed to do anyway let's go Gonna go for Bongo Bongo now. Uh, admittedly, not a difficult boss. Uh, quite a fun boss though, and I really like the um, like uh, the thought behind him, the theory. It's really cool. Um, may as well just save it. All right, are we ready? Let's do this. There he is. He looks weird, man. Phantom Shadow Beast Bongo Bongo. Right, what we do need is just normal... Uh, normal uh, arrows. And we need to shoot the hands. Ah! Ed's Z targeting is being a bit weird here. What, right, is he going to go for me now? Ah, I mistimed it. Shoot. Lame! Right. Oh, what'd she say? Bongo Bongo, boss of the Shadow Temple, revive from the well, look at it with the eye of truth. There, I got him. Right. Gotcha! Behatch. Oh. Why, 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 why? No! Oh, he got me. He's squishing me. Excuse me, would you mind? Excuse me. Yeah, let me go. Thank you. Right, got him, got him, got him, got him. Got him, right. I think that might be it. Yeah, see, he's a bit easy. Good times, though. And he turns into shadow and dies. Ah, love it. See, that just looks a bit weird to me. In your face, Bongo Bongo. Right, we want that, and um, we want, we definitely want this. Get some hearts up. Happy days, happy days. See, I like this little bit because they obviously know that you're going to be wearing the um, hover boots at this time. And so they put the uh, the camera so that the hover boots are like, like that. Uh, if you're not wearing the hover boots, you don't see that. Uh, I think that's cool. They obviously knew that that was going to be a thing. The boy with the noble Zelda's ocarina, as I expected, you have come home. Sorry, you have come. Come home? I don't know where I got that from. I am Impa, one of the Shikar. I am Princess Zelda's caretaker, and I'm <coughs> excuse me, also the, sh the sage that guards the Shadow Temple. 
We, Shikar, have served the royalty of Hyrule from generation to generation as attendants. However, on that day seven years ago, Ganondorf suddenly attacked and Hyrule Castle surrendered after a short time. Ganondorf's target was one of the keys to the Sacred Realm, the hidden treasure of the royal family, the Ocarina of Time. And then she just throws it in a moat. My duty bound me to take Zelda out of Ganondorf's reach. When last I saw you, we, um, as we made our escape from the castle, you were just a lad. Now I see that you have become a fine hero. There's nothing to worry about. The princess is safe now. Soon, you'll meet Princess Zelda face to face, and she will explain everything. True. That is when we, the six wise ones, will seal up the evil king and return peace to Hyrule. I have to stay here. You go to the Princess Zelda's side and protect her on my behalf. Now I put my power, which should be helpful to you, into this medallion. Right, uh, what's next? Um, Spirit Temple, I guess. Happy days. Uh, there's nothing here for us, so let's go straight to um, towards Garuda Valley, I guess. Um, yeah, let's do it. Oh, what we do need to do first, we just need to pause it. <laughs> We'll end that session there. Thank you very much for watching. Do like and subscribe. You can find me on Twitch. Uh, it's twitch.tv forward slash Mellar21. Uh, you can also find me on Twitter. It's at Mellar211. And uh, well, thank you very much for watching. See you next time.